would be kind of awful. I, well, I mean, they're just, they're not stain stains. What happens? Just... Hello, everyone. Hi, everybody. I'm Steve. And I'm Mark. And this is Smokey Steve and Mark. Yes, it is. Either welcome or welcome back. Yes, welcome. It's happy, nice to see everybody. Happy Wednesday. Happy Way in Wednesday. Way in Wednesday. Way in Wednesday. It's not that bad of a Way in Wednesday for no, us. No, it's not. They're never really bad. No. I am not my weight. I am not my weight. Just because we dedicate a whole day to weight doesn't, we're mean, not, doesn't mean we're fixated on it no, or anything. No, no, not at all. No, not at so all. So we have some new lights. We do. This is different. It's blinding. Yeah, I'm I'm squinting a little bit. And I we're think filming it okay. selfie, and it kind of looks... I, I, I think can't see it us now. Better. I just looked at the lights. It looks better, I think. <laughs> it's like staring at the sun. I'm such a dope. I think it looks better. Uh, yeah. We look a little more flesh-toned if we sit Rather back. than yellow. Yeah, we look jaundiced a lot of the time. We'll get there. We'll, we'll get, get there. We'll be all right. We'll yeah. be all right. Once we get the professional studio installed, all will be well. Well, we've got to keep it kind of folksy. I mean, a, a new camera is good. Oh, yeah, a new camera. And that's on the horizon. We're saving for it. So that's, yeah. that's no big deal. That'll be up soon. Yeah. But, well, we're saving for new phones with good cameras in it. Well, that's, I think that's yeah, the plan. That's the electronics priority. Yeah. So yeah. That's, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. First we replace... Got to prioritize. Yeah. So, but anyway, so I, I saw your craft yesterday. Uh, <laughs> the actual, bathing skeleton. <laughs> actually, I saw your craft at two o'clock in the morning because I got up to use the restroom <laughs> at around two, and I go into the bathroom and throw the light, and this thing is glowing. I have and it staring right at behind me. the. I have a we have uh, a, a shelf behind the 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 commode, and mm. I have them right there. Yeah, I almost had a seizure. <laughs> it was very creepy. I didn't, that's great. I didn't anticipate that. So <laughs> so it works. Well, it works. Okay, that's good. It, it works. It, you know, shock appeal. I like it. Yeah. yeah. I have to make the big one for work. That probably, I had a couple comments. Oh, you have to post the, the one you make for work, because it's going to be larger. Um, but we won't do that in probably till the first week of October. Where do you get a skeleton that big? Every it's ha it's everywhere. Everyone oh, has okay. Halloween stuff now. But well, I, it's not life size. Well, I mean, I, mean, I was gonna pretty, say no. Like, it's, the only it's, way to get a life size size skeleton is to, you know, go to Walmart and buy a plastic one. Oh yeah, that yeah. yeah. Well, the if cauldron. You, I mean, it's not the cauldron. Like the one I made for home was a little like a, yeah, a, it was a, a baby. Foot, foot one. The one for work is a two foot one. So I mean, it's you know, it's about that big. Oh, so you only the skeleton that's like four feet tall. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, or, or is it three feet? I can't remember. I ordered it on Amazon. Well, anyway, when it comes, I'll know. Okay. But anyway, yeah, it was it was cute. I liked it. Yeah, that was it's good. a cute little thing. Good and for the, the kiddos. Too. And the fried green tomatoes went down like. They were good. They that were was a good. nice treat last night. I posted it on Facebook. The recipe. So head over to Facebook if you want to print it out and make some fried green tomatoes. I pulled every condiment out of the refrigerator, <laughs> and I was like, I cut a tomato into about seventeen pieces. And I'll, I'll try it in the ranch, and I'll try it in the marinara sauce. If you want to bastardize them, I suggested putting marinara sauce and mozzarella cheese and then broiling Ooh. it like a uh, eggplant parm. It gives you the memory of that a little bit. A fried green tomato parmesan. Yeah. Wow, I've never seen that before. South meets Italy meets, I mean, it's so sacrilege. Wow. But no, it, it would probably be good. be good. It's like a fluffer nutter. It's lowbrow, but it would probably be good. I wonder if I should do that as a special at work. Let's see if it goes over. The fried green, we did it last weekend. Yeah. It worked just the fried green tomatoes, because I have tomatoes at work, too. Mm -hmm. They sold out both yeah. nights. Like, well, I think that's why you did it in the recipe. People think it's fussy, so when they go out, they'll yeah, order and it's they really, don't make it at home. Yeah, and it's really not, so. Nah. Well, anyway, we're rambling. That wasn't as bad as you usually ramble. As I? Me? I? I, I, I don't ramble. Just because I have some 25-minute videos that are only me doesn't right. mean that I ramble. Well... Anyway, okay, rambling we, isn't bad. Now we are rambling. Well, now we're rambling. Going forward. So move, moving on. Moving right along. Mm -hmm. We had a drawing. We have a drawing. Well, it's way in Wednesday. Oh, it's way in Wednesday? We gotta do that. Well, I spoiled it. I spoiled it. Well, today it. We, are gonna, we are gonna do that. We have a drawing today. We have a shout out today. We have all kinds of fun we stuff today. We do have today. fun stuff today, but first we'll get to business. All right, way in Wednesday. Way in Wednesday. Wednesday. You can go first, because yours. All right, I'll go big first. Deal. I was upset last week because I gained. I was two hundred two point five. Oh, I don't know. My clip two. It was two hundred two point five. I think it was five or six. I can't remember. Mm -hmm. And uh, this week I'm one ninety nine point nine. Uh huh. That's so bad. I'm glad. And I it was a wake up call last week because the prior two weeks, remember, we didn't do a weigh in. No. 
And I got, um, let's see, lackadaisical. Is that a good word? Ooh, that, yeah. Big word. Yeah. Uh, on my eating. So I just refocused and I went back to my portion control and all that and everything. And it worked. So I got back down to I'm below 200 by one point. But, you know, that's good. And I'm going to continue to do what I'm doing. And now I can see if I maintain or if I continue to lose a little bit. Yeah. If I continue to maintain, I'll tighten it up a little bit more. Mm-hmm. Because I really do want to hit, you know, 180. 180 is my goal. So. Yeah. So that was my way in Wednesday. Well, mine was, uh, there was change. I didn't plateau again. I was 187.2 for the last, I don't know, four years or something. Yeah, it was, it a, was a long It was a very long time. It, like, to the point. Uh, yeah, that to was, the decimal. That's, and I saw it. Like, it's not a I was, lie. I, I was happy because I had a lot of amazing. desserts in there. Yeah. Um, I was actually uh, 186.8. This oh, so good. I lost point four. All right, well that's good. It's going down. That's and good. I think the my my exercise I was still doing that. Yeah, you over were. The weekends. It's like more like fall weather, so it's not like oh, it's too hot. You yeah, know, there's <laughs> there's no dragging my feet on it, and it hasn't really rained as much as it had been before. Yeah, so that wasn't bad. And we've been eating out of the garden. We have oh like yeah, we have fresh vegetables mm-hmm. every night, cucumbers, tomatoes. Regular red tomatoes, the ones that right. Yeah. I've been eating tomato sandwiches like they're going out of style. Green beans. We had a BLT the other night. It was so good. Yeah. I don't remember the last time I had a BLT. No. I don't I don't either. Oh, it was good. Did the bacon in the oven real crispy during the grease as best we could. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We did use real bacon because it was a special occasion. I haven't had a BLT I in know. three years. I, mean, I, I haven't either. I know. I've lost point four of a pound. If I would have lost point six without the BLT, oh well. Oh well, that's true. I can live with myself. And okay. tonight's that's cheat night. night. Tonight is cheat night. <laughs> so way in Wednesday, we always have cheat night on Wednesday night. Yeah. What are we gonna have? I don't know. I say burgers or something. Yeah, we always get burgers. I want pizza. We always get pizza. No, because every time we go now, you're like, you know, burgers are on sale, even if they're not. <laughs> and then you're like, well, if we buy four of them, you get like a nickel off or something. So then it turns We like those White Castle burgers that come in the box and you steam them. I just think they're good. I don't know why. They are a nightmare to prepare. Oh you, my gosh. You've got to take steam the steamer. Them. Yeah, you, you don't do it. Uh, no, I don't. Because okay. it's so easy to do. Because it's tedious. You have to take the foil, put it in the steamer, put the steamer in the thing. Don't let the burger touch the side. And then that's like 12 minutes. You put the lid on. It's too much fuss. It's fussy. Okay. You can microwave them. There's microwave directions. And you microwave them anyway because you don't trust my cooking. Well, you do them so fast, I don't think you cook them all the way through. Steamed for 14 minutes? And I think they're pre-cooked when you get them. He said 14. Didn't he say 12 a little bit ago? See, if it was 14 minutes, I wouldn't microwave it. It's 12 to 14 for frozen. But you don't do 14. And it's 10 to 12 12. for thawed. So I cut the difference in the middle. Okay. Well, anyway, we'll decide that later, I guess, what we're going to have for cheat night. I guess we will. It'll be pizza, probably. Well, I could go for pizza. (laughs) We'll get pizza with a funky topping or something. All right. Okay. All right. We'll get, we'll get, yeah. All right. All right. We'll do that. We'll do that. All right. Okay. That would be fine. All right. So that's settled. Yes. Thank you for, uh, you know, <laughs> staying with us while we settled that. Yeah. If you're still watching, God bless you. I know. Uh, right? Gosh. Yeah. We were just saying how we're going to stop rambling and. Oh, oh perfect timing. Oh. Perfect timing. See? It's time to go to the disco. Mm. Dun, 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 dun. Actually. I've been really into that new Kesha song. Oh, Kesha. Best Day of Your Life. Yeah, well, you're into the refrain. <laughs> I really like that song. It doesn't even sound like Kesha. It's the theme to the new Angry Birds movie. And it's such a fun, and it has such a positive message, too. It, it's a, it's all positive. And, mm-hmm. and so, I mean, how could you not like it? I've heard it yet. And it's like kind of dancey, kind of, I don't know. It's really fun. I don't know. Check it out. See if you guys like it. Yeah. You've heard it. I probably have heard it. You've heard it. But anyway, we have a shout out. I've heard you singing it. All right. So today's shout out goes to Lisa Cox in Akron, Pennsylvania. Lisa! So, (laughs) you get confetti. You get confetti, Lisa, just for you. We all get confetti. The cat gets confetti. We do, yes. Everybody gets confetti. Yes. Now, she's from Akron, Akron, Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. I didn't even know there was an Akron, Pennsylvania. I know everyone's like Akron, Ohio. Ohio, that's what I thought. So, Akron is in Lancaster County, oh. which is well known for Amish folks. Mm-hmm. Usually, like, that's what everyone knows it for. Yeah. Like, Amish things. Um, there are basically two main roads. There is Main Street and 7th Street. 
So it's got a population of about 4,000 people. It's oh, about, it's a little small. Too. It's a little small. It's about 20 minutes from downtown Lancaster City. Oh. Which is the okay. eighth largest city in Pennsylvania. So it's it's kind of a little, it's got a decent metro area. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. What else? Um, it has a unique New Year's Eve tradition. This was the most outlandish thing. Called the shoe-in. Okay. There's rides, carriage rides, music. Oh, there's a bonfire. So nice. And in honor of the area's former shoemaking industry, a giant sneaker is lowered at midnight. <laughs> That's pretty cool. That is fantastic. I have to Google that. That, that is, so, is cool. so cool. You know, Lancaster, we get down there. I have family there. My brother lives yeah. in suburban Lancaster. So we've been down from time to time. And a thousand years ago, I had an ex who lived in Lidditz. So I've, I've spent some time Lidditz down there. Lidditz is a nice little town, too. Oh, I've been there. Oh, yeah, that pretzel factory thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The Sturgis pretzel factory. La I Lancaster, think. I mean, overall, I think is beautiful. I used to go there in the fall. Yeah. And, you know, see the leaves. And they have Dutch Wonderland. Dutch Wonderland. I remember that as a child going there. And mm -hmm. what sticks out are the divers. Mm -hmm. the, and I, I hear they still have the divers to this day. So, yeah. I, you know, it does hold memories for me. I'd love to go back there. We were supposed to go this summer, but we did. Oh, I got sick. The weekend we were going to go, I got sick. But, yeah, yeah Lanc I like Lancaster, actually. Yeah, good smorgasbords, too. Yeah. So, today, Lisa, we, we celebrate, celebrate you. you Thank you for watching. Thank you for commenting. Thank yeah. you for being a subscriber. We appreciate it. Yes, we do. Thank you very much. And if you would like a shout out, leave your name and where you're from below. And we will give you one. We do them about once, twice a week. They're done at random. Basically, yeah. Mark holds the clipboard and I blindly point and land I like on move somebody. it all around. So, <laughs> and then once a month, we draw from the folks who've had a shout out and you are, get a chance to win one of Mark's pieces of handiwork. Yep. Yeah. One of his candle Our holders. monthly shout out contest. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I make little candle holders if you haven't seen them. And They're one very, of our shout outs a month. They're very one. sharp. Yeah, yeah, they're pretty cool. I like them myself. So yeah, but now what? So since we're celebrating, yeah, I think we should go right to the contest. To because, the contest. Yeah. This is where I, I jumped the gun earlier because I was so excited. <laughs> I was like, contest, contest, contest. Well, the <laughs> funny thing is, this is the Golden Girls contest, and the contest was to answer two questions. It was an email contest. Answer two questions by email, and you'll be entered into a contest, and we'll draw a winner. And we were supposed to do it a week later. And then life happened. We had the car break down, the microwave break down. We, our schedules got whoosh, swapped. Everything was so busy. And I wrote it like on a, a list to, to remember our mm -hmm. dates. Well, the list got buried, buried, it's buried. It's probably somewhere in here. It's in there. I pulled it out. Yeah. And what I am so shocked is, is that it was nowhere in here. Yeah. Nowhere just in here at all. If I don't write it down, it just does not happen. Mm -hmm. But anyway, I was like, oh my goodness, we got to do it. <laughs> I yeah. forgot all about. But anyway, so the uh, contest was uh, our Golden Girls special. We asked, what is Mark's favorite Golden Girls episode? And what is Steven's favorite Golden Girls episode? Mm -hmm. And I get well, I guess we should give the answers if you don't know them. Mm -hmm. Yours was? Journey to the Center of Attention. Yes, and mine was? The Operation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those are our favorite episodes. So... Out of every, and since there was a, another week that people could enter, people did. So we had a total of 26 people enter. Mm. Now, that's, in my opinion, pretty good odds for a contest. I'd say so. Yes. So they're all in our little Coffee Mate mug here. You're shaking the couch. Shake, 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 shake. I know, watch. The, the backdrop's going to fall. I need some drama, I mean, I think. <laughs> all right. Are you going to draw? Yeah, I'll draw. All right. But you can't look. You have to. Okay. Just pick one. Okay. I just got one. And it's for Kathy R. in Roanoke, Virginia. Kathy R. in Roanoke, Virginia! The, you get the last of the confetti. Yes! Congratulations, <laughs> Catherine! Okay, so you have a couple days to get in touch with us. Well, or we can get in touch with you. I obviously have your email address. Yeah. And you won a digital gift basket. And in that digital gift basket are uh, gift cards for Uber. It was a $25 Uber gift card, a $10 Uber Eats gift card, which can be combined. Mm -hmm. So they would have $35 for Uber Eats if they wanted. There's a Starbucks gift card, Dunkin' Donuts gift card, and then a movie night out for AMC movie theaters. There's a gift certificate and uh, free popcorn and free soda. 
and there's red box codes. It's just a fun digital gift basket and you want it. So congratulations, I'll get that to you. I don't have to mail it, I can just yeah, it's all electronic, digitally right? send you the codes. Yeah, mm -hmm. <clears throat> makes all these. One of them has a, a, a barcode too, so I can send that too. Yeah, cool. So listen, thank everybody who entered. Thank you so much for taking part of the contest. It was so much fun. Mm -hmm. I, I, I really had a good time and we're planning our next special, so. Yeah, it's not gonna be this month. No, 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 it won't. No, it's definitely not. No, we need to. I need time no. to heal and recoup. I like the specials. I'm still I think detoxing. I they think. are a lot of work, but I do think they're a lot of fun. I'm still having the twitch. But yes, the thank you, uh, everybody, for taking part of it. Mm -hmm. Um, and and stay tuned. We're gonna have more contests because I totally dig contests. Yeah, it's usually <laughs> as soon as one ends, another one starts. Yeah. So yeah, stay tuned. By the end of the week, beginning of next week, something else will be brewing. Something else will be brewing. You never know, something right? Be brewing. Yeah. I think we'll do a Halloween theme special. Yes, That's what I'm thinking. We're gonna do Halloween theme stuff until Christmas. Forget yeah. Thanksgiving. Forget Thanksgiving. We're gonna I don't plow... particularly care for Thanksgiving. But... See, I love Thanksgiving. It's my favorite holiday because it's like Christmas without the BS. Yeah. There's no presents. No. There's no. Meh. All you have is the food, and then after you're and everybody leaves. No one. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> there's no gifts, there's no toys that make noise, there's no, that's mine, that's it. All right, I give you that. Okay, it yeah. might not be your favorite, but I think it's a step up from Christmas. Oh, I like Christmas. I, I like Christmas, I just like Thanksgiving better. It's less fussy. I'm looking forward to the holidays. Anyway, so I think we should end on, on a high note with confetti high note. and I think that's blinking lights and mm -hmm. everything. I think that would be fun, right? I think so. Well, thank you all so much for watching. It was really, really, really great spending time with you. Thank you. Please subscribe. Hit the like button. Yes. You can follow Mark and I on Facebook at Smokey Steve Space and Mark. Yep. Mark follows up on Facebook daily. Mm -hmm. uh, articles he finds interesting, contests, freebies. Um, pictures fun of us. pictures. Fun stuff. <laughs> fun stuff. Uh, you can follow us on Instagram also at SmokeyStevenMark, one word. Mm -hmm. Our email address and our contact info is below, like our P.O. box and stuff like that. Thank you for watching, and we will catch up with you all later. Yes, Bye. we will. Bye, everybody. See you next time.